Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. This is Toriel Sultan. If you haven't watched my previous video, it's an in and out in-depth tutorial on how to use Outscraper to scrape Google Map data. However, in this video, I want to show you guys a little bit more on tips and tricks to pull even more data. So you can see here, this is a Google Map in Vancouver, Canada. If I type restaurant here, here is a list of all the restaurants, right? However, default by Google, Google doesn't just give you unlimited restaurants. At some point, I did reach to the bottom. You can see I've reached to the end of this list. This is Vancouver, Canada. It's impossible. There's only 500 restaurants inside of this entire city. So I want to show you guys a workaround on how to pull even more than 500 locations. And now let's quickly come back to our scraper. Let's come to the first option here. It says map. You can see category. I typed restaurant, right? For demonstration purpose, I'm going to choose New York as an example. This is New York City. If you click on advanced parameters, you can see here, right? Places pre one quick search is actually 500. This is set by Google. Let's close on advanced parameters, click on get data. We're going to find around 300 locations based on this query search. This is because of this limit that's set with Google. Here's a trick to work around. So click on it one more time. Instead of going with the city name, we're going to go after zip codes. You can see I searched up New York here. Here's an entire list of all the zip codes in New York. And check this out. Instead of individually selecting all the zip code, I'm going to click on New York and this is select all these zip codes fall into New York City. And now if I click on get data one more time, here is an entire list of zip codes in New York City. Instead of cap with a 300 or 500 limits, here is a new estimate. It's roughly 2,600 all the way up to close to 10,000, 9,600 to be specific. So that is a little trick on how to avoid the 500 cap, the limit that Google sets in terms of the query search. So we can pull even more data and location based on zip code or post a code instead of going after CD name. Right before we wrap up this video, just wanted to give you guys a before and after. As you can see here today, I pulled two different queries. They're both exact the same query, which is a spa in Vancouver. So you can see if I just go to Vancouver as a city, I pulled 13 to 24 entry in total. I used the post a code method. You can see with this method, we're able to pull way more than just 1300, 3791 entries in total. Hope you enjoyed this video. Drop some likes and some some comments. If you do want to see some more Outscraper tutorials, make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell. This is Toriel Sultan signing out. I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.